I want to teach you how to use OPT <clears throat> strategy on lower time frame. OPT strategy is my new strategy and I have to keep training you guys because it's a game changer. So in this video, lesson 85, I want to teach all of you how to use OPT on lower time frame. First, you need to understand that even if you're using OPT strategy, you have to do a top-down analysis. And in this case, we are starting from weekly. This is GBP, GBP LD, and this is live analysis. Whatever we analyze here, you can double check, you can analyze. So what we are getting in this uh, uh, GBP LD, it's a support area that has not been, been broken for how many times? Three attempts, can you see? So the market has not attempted to break this. So there are people who will say, this is a triple bottom. So there's someone who will look at this market and they call it triple bottom. There's someone who will look at this market and they call it a double bottom that might give or uh, might result to a cup and handle. So even if you call it an inverted cup and handle, it is not yet accurate because it has not broken through. So there's someone who will check on it. They're not seeing a triple bottom, but they will see these are market that if it happens to break on the downside, I have an inverted cup and handle. So it starts from what are you seeing? You know, when you open your chart, what you're seeing is not what your neighbor is seeing. You might see something different and all of you, you will get to the same answer. It's just like saying five plus five is 10 and still saying four plus six is 10. So you are coming to the same answer, but you did the same, a different thing. Now, for me, there's this pattern I don't like training, but I will use it here for the purpose of this video. It's called a uh, head and shoulder. So it's where the market has the first uh, shoulder and then it has the head and then it gets the shoulder. What mostly happens if the market gets the shoulder and it fails to break the neckline, the market always go back to the head. That's something that I knew long time ago and I want to practice on this trade. So what I'm trying to tell you is that this is the shoulder guys and this is the neckline. Can you see? And this is our head. So this is the shoulder, the left shoulder, the neckline, the left, the right shoulder, and the head. So what happens is that it's either the shoulder breaks down, it's either the shoulder comes and breaks down like this, or the shoulder breaks that right shoulder and go back to the head. So that's the rule of head and shoulder. Now, understanding that, I already know that if I get a buy opportunity, the market might even go up. And those are many, many pips. You know, GBP would carry so many pips. We are talking of 811 pips. So already you understand that in this case, we do not have a winner. We don't have a buy uh, as the winners and we don't have the sell as the winners. So if I go to the daily time frame, I still see the same thing. I will still see the same head and shoulder, meaning this head and shoulder, it's this is the shoulder, this is the head, and this is the shoulder. It's either the market comes down or go up. So are we together up to there? So when you're trying to do OPT, you don't want to find one pattern on, on many time frames. No, you want to find one pattern on lower time frame. But even if you are finding one pattern on one time frame, you still need to understand the history of that pair. You still need to understand the story so that you know the OPT you are looking for because there's the OPT to sell and there's the OPT to buy. There's the pattern to sell, that's what I mean, and there's the pattern to, to buy. So when we go to four hour, something changes. I squeeze my chart like this. Note, as we are waiting for either the head and shoulder to break, I have a zone already. This is a double bottom. So this is where now, once you start being specific, oh, I can see a pattern, you have first to ask yourself, is it on the higher time frame so that you can get your first OPT?
is it on the daily? So we'll go to the daily to check if it is there. Guys, do you think it is there? It's not there. It's not there. So that's how you get your OPT. Why? Because first you understand the story of the market. By the time you're going to four hour, you'll be able to spot it. Why? Because I want anything that can buy this market like a double bottle. And for sure, you'll find it. So let's see our half. Can you see what has happened? The market has already broken our half. So the question is, do I enter to the neckline? And this is a live market. Do I enter to the neckline or I wait? So if you enter right now up to, to the neckline, it will be 133 pips. If you wait, if you wait, either for retracement or you're just waiting without a reason, this trade will go away. But I want to teach you again how you have reason. Yes, the market has broke, but like I said, this is the only zone on four hour that has not been activated. So that zone is invalidated. So we have to ask ourselves, what made this market to go down? That's why we are now starting to go to lower time frame. So if you go to uh, two hours, we have a zone like that. Can you see? We have a zone like that. So this is GBP Audi on two hours. Note the GBP on four hour has the double bottom broken half. Before we enter, you still need to know that there is no other contrary OPT on lower time frame. We are not interested. Don't make a mistake. If you have double bottom on four hour and double bottom on two hours, of course you'll trade on four hour. But if you have a double bottom on four hour and a double top on two hours, the double top on two hours is more likely to sell. So we go to two hours. Nothing. The market has not activated. We go to one hour and we find the market has activated. Can you see? Guys, I hope you see. So this is OPT on one hour. So I want all your attention, all your eyes, everything. I want you to come and camp here for entry. It is very easy for entry. Why? Because it, you'll be checking one time frame. So if you go to two hours, you can't see that double top. That's what we are saying. If you go to four hours, there's no that double top. But when you go to one hour, so there's no even need of going to 30 minutes because one hour is overall. As long as two hours does not have, it is like that. So we still have to measure our half. And note this on the, on the double bottom. This one on the double bottom broke half. So this is a, a double top. So you can see the distance where the market is going. Let me make this like blue like that. So we already know that current support is the one that give us an entry. So I want you, by the time you're watching this video, this is what I want you to comment. Has the market done CSB, number one? Has it hit our half of the take profit or is it at the neckline CSB? So those are the three things I want you to observe and comment below. Make sure you comment. You see, if you fail to comment, what will motivate me to create this video surely? So you have to comment and say, has the CSB activated? That is one. Has the half been, TP have been hit and the neckline? So those are, some of the things I want you to check and so that this video can be helpful. Always note, you can have a pattern on four hour that is the double top and a, the double bottom on four hour that is not on daily and a double top that is on one hour and it is not on the, it is not on the four hour. So it is, it's just a game to play 
Yeah, and like I've kept saying, OPT strategy is well described in my module in my course. So if you want more learning materials or you want a course, it goes for $400 and it's a recorded class. It's a course of 12 modules. So you just WhatsApp me and get that course. Hope this GBP, and this is one hour, so it will happen fast. Hope they will break here so that we can get an entry. If they fail and they break above, that market is going this distance, at least half of it. And that will be supporting our buy. It will be supporting our buy on the, on the channel. So that's what we'll see. In case the same one hour breaks. So my, I'm not biased anyway, because the double bottom on four is telling me to buy and it has broken half. And because half has been broken, the double top on one hour, so the double bottom is telling me to buy, the double top on one hour is telling me to sell. So the only way I can get rid of this double top, if only they can break like that. But if they don't, they break below, we will keep selling until we see a danger. So GBPOD is OPT on one hour. All the best guys, remember gold is OPT on four hours. All the best guys, see you in the next lesson. Bye-bye, love you.